I'm Johnny. Um, I'm from the north of England, just just north of Manchester. I grew up in a Christian home. We went to church every Sunday. My attitude to church growing up, I think as a child, was probably, to some extent, a disinterest. Um, not completely, though. When I was about 12 years old, um, I went off to a boarding school in Wales, um, which had a Christian element to it. After leaving school, I set business up. Um, I learned crafts. I learned how to, to renovate and to repair buildings. I'd work just all the time um, because I love doing that. But I don't necessarily think that there was much thought towards the future. I went back to the family home initially um, and I went back to church, I went to church in the kind of early years of that. Um, but certainly in my early 20s, I kind of drifted away from the church. So I suppose I was, I had quite a successful kind of business and work set up. Um, I absolutely loved what I was doing. Um, but COVID hit and it was a time of reflection and I'd always wanted to go and study architecture. So I thought, well, maybe now or never. I made a very sort of last minute decision really to come to Glasgow to study. When you make a decision like that, it's rather big and a lot of things change, where you live change, what you do day to day changes. So at that point, it was a point to really think about everything in life. Um, and I, I had this idea that actually I should reconsider church. Um, I stumbled a little along the Trump church really, I was just walking past one day and just sort of nosied in and I could see people. Um, and at that point I just started coming to Bible studies and the Bible study struck me as something where people were really serious about what they were doing. Um, and I like that. Uh, if I'm gonna do something, I'm gonna go for it and, and do it, not half-heartedly do something. Um, and there was a, a real humbleness, I think, and sort of a different kind of character and quality about the people. Um, at, at church, and certainly this church. Yeah, basically, um, I just kept going. Um, I, kept, I kept attending the, the Bible study. Yeah, and it was, it was, it was good, it was very helpful. Um, and we really unpicked a lot of things. And I think if you're gonna do anything seriously, it's more involved than just attending something and listening and all. You're thinking about it when you, you know, in the day-to-day -day of life and, and you're praying. So it, I suppose if you like, it was a, it was a seeking out, or, or I was seeking the Lord. Um, and as I was moving forward with that, I was continuing to seek and I was starting to ask and it went from there really. Um, and then there isn't a, like a, a moment when one would say that, you know, life was transformed. Being a Christian isn't one of those things where you become a Christian and therefore everything after there is plain sailing and you're perfect. That's completely not the case. But you just have to continue and battle on. Um, and at times it is hard, at times it's challenging. But ultimately, it's nice to know that actually God is ultimately in control of all things. And especially when things go upside down, things go wrong, that the Lord actually does have a plan and that he is, you know, he does oversee everything. And that ultimately, you know, he's a kind and loving God. So his plan is, is gonna be one which is good, good for us and good for other people and good for, for him and bring glory to him.